we shall discuss about dependence of man on animals human beings depend on other animals in various ways such as dependence for food dependence for clothing dependence for reducing pollution dependence for medicine dependence for transportation dependence for agriculture etc let us try to understand how human beings depend on other animals human beings depend on animals in various ways such as dependence for food clothing medicines reducing pollution transportation and agriculture first dependence for food one honey we get honey from honeycomb of honey bees smoke is used by the honey gatherers to chase away the bees and they collect honey from honeycomb here you have two pictures figure 1 and figure 2 showing honeycomb with honey bees to meat we get meat from goat chicken sheep pig bovine beef cattle etc 3 eggs we get eggs from hen duck and different types of poultry birds for milk we get milk from cow goat yak sheep etc here you have four pictures figure three red meat figure four hens egg figure five ducks egg figure six cow milk number two dependence for clothing one we get silk from the cocoons of silkworms silk is used to make cloth larva transformed into cocoon two we get wool from sheep rabbit yak etc wool is used to make sweater here you have six pictures figure seven adult silk moth figure eight silk worm figure nine cocoon of silk worm figure ten different types of wool figure 11 alpaca produces wool figure 12 wool producing angora rabbit number three dependence of human beings on animals for medicine we get liver oil from liver of some sea fishes like shark whale and cod it is called shark oil or 
whale oil or cod liver oil. It is rich in vitamin A and vitamin D. Vitamin A is good for our eyes. Vitamin D keeps our bones and teeth strong. Vitamin is an important component of our diet. Deficiency of vitamins cause some diseases. Here you have two pictures, figure 13 cod liver oil and figure 14 shark liver oil. Number 4 dependence for reducing pollution. Animals like crow, vulture, pig, etc. also help to reduce pollution by sweeping dirty materials from our surroundings. Crow and vulture eat rotting and decaying flesh of dead bodies and thus dispose of the bodies of dead animals. Crows are called sweeper birds. Vultures are called scavenging birds. And thus they keep our ecosystem healthy. Pig also eat the filth and thus help man to keep the environment healthy. Here you have two pictures, figure 15, sweeper bird crow and figure 16, cleaning bird vulture. We are watching now that a pig is searching for field and thus pig helps us to reduce pollution. Number 5 Dependence for Transportation 1. Bullock cart is an usually two wheeled vehicle pulled by oxen. It is a mode of transportation in villages to carry rice and vegetables. In ancient time, bullock cart was used as an one of the most important mode of public transportation. 2. Horse drawn carriers. Horse drawn carriers is a four wheel nowadays bullock cart or horse drawn carriers is replaced by cycle van buses trains taxis etc here you have two pictures figure 17 bullock cart figure 18 horse drawn carriers Six dependence for agriculture. Ox and cow have been serving farmers for cultivation of paddy since the very dawn of civilization. Horse was used for paddy transportation and irrigation. Now machines, that is tractors, began to take their places. So we may conclude that human beings depend on other animals in various ways. Here you have two pictures. Figure 19 oxen used for plowing. Figure 20 horse is used in Thank you.
for watching this video stay with the channel to get more videos